Good morning, Reef people. I had uh, <clears throat> to clean my budget protein to skimmer here because uh, I, I started using Nopox and that stuff works amazingly well. But one of the byproducts is you get just you you get this bacteria muck everywhere. So usually I didn't clean a protein skimmer, but two or three times a year, and now it's it's going to be a lot more. Anyway, that's not the point. I digress. The point is. Some time ago, I was asked a question specifically about this protein skimmer. At what level of water, what is the minimum amount of water in which it would work? And I didn't know the answer to that. So I took this opportunity to, to pop it in my saltwater mixing station. And what I've done here is labeled the... the kitty, 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 take a break. She's really after me this morning. <laughs> okay, I'm back. I put her away. <laughs> she's getting old and she's getting very needy. I guess I'm getting that way too. Anyway, what I've done is marked on this aquarium uh, inches and the top of where I have it mixed is about 11. It goes all the way down to 2. And the way I operate this ice cap uh, K100 is I have the bubbles just about to the top of this right here. The gate valve is all the way open, which is A all low, H is high, it's all the way open. So let's see what happens at 11 inches. Well, that's actually not too far from where I would run it. But it's uncontrollable at this point. I have no room left on the gate bow. So let's take an inch out and see what happens. Okay, so we're trying to find the maximum. Uh, and th this is down to 10 inches. Let's turn her on. She's coming, she's coming, she's coming. So since that's below the neck, that means I have a little bit of control if I need it. Voila. So let's call the maximum 10, 10 inches. Now I'm going to go way down. I don't want to bore you guys with every inch, so I'll just take out a bunch and we'll see. Okay, we're down to 7 inches, which is where I run it, and that's the sweet spot. So you have lots and lots of room to adjust. Coming up, coming up, coming up. Woo, woo, woo. So, that's where I run it. Now let's keep going. Okay, we're down to five inches of water. And it's still working. Uh, I'm impressed. I didn't, I didn't know it would do that. And you have control. Up and down. Let's keep going. Okay, here we are. We were at four until I turned it on. <clears throat> At four inches, and uh, it's not working. I mean, it is it is pushing water up the column, but it's not it's not doing a venturi, and it's not mixing it with air. So uh, I had to take uh, the silencer off because I spilled water in it. But that doesn't have anything to do with it. Okay, so the answer is uh, between five and ten, and I think seven's a sweet spot. So there you go. I apologize for forgetting your name.